Jesus, that is a lot to take in, Jean. Hey, uh, Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlians here with Jean and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? You know, just you and me, uh, our favorite people, our favorite, uh, you and I, our best pals. Okay, listen, just, just, it's easy. Put the other Gatlians down next to Jean and let's get out of here, look for Lizzie and have a chat. Can we do this with just you and me? You know, we can leave them with Jean, the other guns. You know, they, they're not gonna mind. I don't mean to be pushy, but can we just drop the other Gatlians off next to Jean? Why aren't you worried about your sister? Like, like me? Oh, sure, we can use a little break. It's nice to stretch out a bit, you know? Take a little nappy poo. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Change the channel, Gene, to porn. Have a good time, you two. We'll hold down the four. All right, bounty hunter, let's head to Applebee's and we're, we're, let's find your sister. Look at us, just you and me again, you know? Just like old times, like the dream team, you know? Uh, so Applebee's, it's in the slums, which you, you know, you, you probably knew that. So your suit can point us in the right direction. So you take the lead, bounty hunter. You, you, you know, we'll talk with, you know, we'll, we'll, we're gonna, we're, we're gonna chat. It's gonna be good. It's gonna, it's all good. Don't worry about this. Don't get shooken up about this. I don't, I, there's no reason to be, uh, you know, d don't feel weird or anything. I'm not trying, you know what I mean? Stop. Great. Hey, listen, I'm sorry about being weird back there. It's I'm just, walking, well, go oh, there's something I need to tell you. Whew, this is, this is hard. Just give me a second. Oh, you got this, Kenny. Come on. Hey, you I doing? hope you're having Making a great day, Bounty Hunter. And I hope you go fuck yourself. All right, Kenny, you're talking to yourself now. They can hear you. It's not so hard. Just tell them everything. Broken leg guy still here. See you later. <laughs> you you never judge me, right? Hey, buddy, I mean, we're such close partners pieces. at this point. Fuggles. You know, like nothing I could say could ruin that, right? <laughs> I'm just just kidding around. Just I'm just joking around. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm out of my body right now. I think. Yeah. Hey, um, is the sludge toxic up there? Boy, okay, so that um, that dying Gatlian that we saved, let's do it. Let's say we can fix him up and he, you know, back alive. The thing is, oh, okay, sorry, sorry. I, I'm just trying to figure out how to say this properly, or, or you know, like communicate um, how we normally do, right? You know, the Gatlian we saved, let's do it. Uh, he knows some things about me that 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 the others don't know, and it's, a, it's nothing too crazy, you know. It's, it, it, okay, no, it's it's bad. It's really bad. Sorry, I don't mean to be cryptic. I'm just, oh, this is tough. You know, this is really hard. I, I just don't want you to hate me. Oh, I love this. You know damn well this isn't sanitary. All right, we are. Uh, we are heading to Applebee's in the slums, and I'm worried about your sister. You, you think Tweak is working today? Welcome to Applebee's. Table for two, right this way. Oh, uh, actually, we're wondering if someone named Tweak is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to talk. Uh, yes. We, we, we will, we will take a table. Enjoy your meal. Your waiter will be with you shortly. Thank you. Okay, listen, I I'm sorry for making us sit here at Applebee's. I know we're really focused on Lizzie and that's kind of the important thing, but would you mind if I kind of got something off my chest here with you first?
Whew, okay, thanks. You know, it's just, you know, it, it's gonna weigh me down if I don't say something. Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? It got taken over by the G3, like yours. You know, all my people got enslaved. You, you, you remember that, right? You know all that, right? Sorry, of course you do. Well, um, what if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? Uh, okay, I, I can see you're at a loss for words. I, I, I know how it sounds. I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm going to be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started with one of our signature cocktails? Uh, not, not now, please. We're, we're kind of busy here. Okay, sure thing. I'm going to go ahead and get that in for you. Uh, thank you. Okay, bounty hunter, so l l let me explain. Gatlas was isolated on the far edge of an asteroid belt. We were completely untouched by the greater interstellar civilization, j just like your planet. But, you know, I, I wanted out. Like, I wanted to see the galaxy. I wanted to see what everything out there had to offer. That's when Rel Del Mar crashed his ship into our planet. He was this crazy smuggler. He, he'd been all over and he'd seen it all. And, 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 and after I helped him fix his ship, he wanted me to be a part of his crew, you know? And he, he took me with him. And I'm back. Here we go. This is for you. All right, now what were you thinking for an appetizer? Uh, I'm sorry. We're in the middle of something, please. Great, it's coming right up. Oh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but wh where were we? Okay, oh, right, um, obviously a guy like Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers, and, well, you know, that led us to the G3, and Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower, and, well, looking back, you know, I see how stupid I was, you know, I, I really do, but at the time, I couldn't tell, you know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. You no, know, everyone thought I was a fuck up. You know, I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something. You know. Open up. Here comes the appetizer train. Chicka 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 choo choo. Thank you. I ho hope you like those. Now you better be ready to order that main course. You betcha. I'm gonna get that order right to the cook. Okay, thank you. So. I led the G3 right to Gatlas. Do you see where I'm going with this? We fought them off at first, you know, but they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. You know, a few of us were immune. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Let's Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now, about how I left Gatlas to pal around with a criminal, how I led Garmantuous and the G3 right to our planet, how I got everyone killed, except Let's Do It survived. Somehow, the G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. God, if we can really bring him back, do, do, do you see my problem, right? Like, I, I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did, you know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Emotional thing. Uh, you know, this is important baggage shit we're dealing with here. Take a hint and get out of here for a second. Uh-oh, -uh, someone's feeling grumpy. Oh, wonderful. Now, wh what the fuck is happening outside? Lizzie? Don't follow us. Twig and I are in love, and we're going to travel the galaxy in his space RV. Uh, actually, this is moving kind of fast. Not Help me, please. that sentence. We're in okay, love. we gotta get to them. Oh, shit, yeah. We, I can't dine and dash. I love this place. Don't want to get blacklisted. Oh, fuck. Okay, this, this, this changes shit. This is bad. Live in downtown Blue City, where, as you can see, we have been invaded by violent and agitated G3 cartel forces. No one can say for sure why they're here. We're here to kill you, bounty hunter. <laughs> ah, okay. Well, there you have it. It looks like this is only a problem if you are that bounty hunter that they're trying to kill. I'm People Fuckerton, Blim City News. Stay safe out there. Uh, no, I've got some more pants.
Would you stop fucking around? She could be in danger. I can't believe I'm saying that. Right, let's go, we're gonna hurry. Oh yeah, I've been here the whole time, but, but don't worry, I'll keep your secret safe. I'm, I'm not a snitch. Uh, five, eight, 
Close. I may be 230, but I don't want to die yet. Are we? D d did we make it? Yeah. We're safe. Nobody on our tail, but uh, where are we? Am I missing something? I'm not picking up any signs of life out there. Then we're in the right spot. Kenny, where did you just take us? It was the only safe place I could think of. Careful. It's toxic out there. I set up an atmos bubble so you can breathe, so don't wander too far. Or do. What does it matter anymore? Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? Pretty soon Earth is gonna look like this too. We have got to stop the G3, bitch. Sorry, nobody answered me. I asked if this was our home. Anyone? How is it out there? We, we, we don't want to talk about it. That bad, huh? Well, uh, don't get all depressed about it. we still got more guys out there to kill. Let's powwow real quick. Look, I hate to be pushy, but are you ready for your next bounty? You know what, kid? Maybe you should get some rest. Let's save the bounty hunting for tomorrow. Head on upstairs. I'll take care of things down here. I hate to say it, but Gene's right. Let's get some shut-eye. We'll make this right starting tomorrow. Hey, come over here. What's up? I gotta tell you something. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like, anything gross? Y y you have to tell me. Like, seriously, come on. We're best friends now. Hobbies has a brand new sandwich. All right, good night. Me to tell you about. What is it? All right, you're finally up. Okay, let's get back to it, I guess, you know? I, I, I hope Gene has a lead on Lizzie. Let's go. Yeah, look who finally decided to wake up. You know how late it is? Because I don't. There's no sun on this dead rock of a planet. By the way, I got you a little sum sum. A new suit upgrade. Extra overshield. You're welcome. Let's get to business. I've got something you'll like. You can breathe easy. I'll get right to it. I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. Oh, that's great. So, so she's... She's alive. Don't worry. But she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. If you're ready, just step through the portal door. I don't know what I want. Okay, fine, I don't know either. Isn't the sex good? I don't know. I can't even tell if we're doing it right. We're aliens. None of our shit even lines up correctly. You could be pregnant and I would fucking wonder how that happened. My cum goes all over outside of your body. Well, okay. I don't know if it's good either. Your body is really confusing. God, I'm just so confused. Aren't we in love? You're asking me that, dude. You're the one who dragged me out on this trip. I wasn't looking for anything serious. I just wanted to get laid. But even that turned out to be some weird 
fucking Hellraiser puzzle. Oh, shut up. Don't blame this on me. There's plenty of ways you could have figured out how to use my equipment, so to speak. Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, yeah, thank God. You came just in time to save me. Me is who you came to save. Thank you. Fuck your sister, dude. Woo. Cuckoo. Girls, am I right? Love is tough. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I don't know. We were a little worried about you. God, everyone needs to chill out. When have you smoked? What, you're a smoker now? Wait, what is it? Camels? Marble? 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 Marbleos? Marble? Marble? Marbleos? Marbleos? I don't know. What's it to you? What do you want? Uh, no shit. Yeah, we're yelling at each other. You want a fucking medal for being able to figure out when two people are fighting? Okay, Einstein. Hey, you want us to throw you a parade or something for figuring out the most obvious shit? Okay, honestly, now it seems like the two of you are getting along. Yeah, that's the problem. Sometimes we're happy together. Yeah, if we just hated each other all the time, fucking, I wouldn't be here. And you'd be playing some rock star game, you fucking asshole. <laughs> But we love each other. <laughs> I don't know. I, I thought this would help. Just us getting away together. My old life's fucked. Everyone else is doing their own thing. I just wanted... I wanted to bang someone on a rocket Winnebago in space. So sue me. Me too, Lizzie. Your body terrifies me in every way imaginable, but... Yeah, me too. <clears throat> what? Oh, yeah? How? Yeah, how about you just let me handle this on my own? You already decided to become a weird alien killing expert. Don't strain yourself trying to be a dating expert, too. Um, yeah, no offense, but you're kind of butting in, dweeb. Hey, only I can talk to them that way. And look, I'm sorry I dragged you out here. Really, I am. I know you didn't want to. But I just, I wanted to know for sure if, if we worked or not. Oh yeah, it's cool. I forgive you. I just think, oh, oh, really? Even after forcing you to leave with me? Yeah, okay, it's fine, yeah. Did you know I almost sold you out to the G3? They were offering, like, a lot of pesos to find out where you were. And that would have been way worse. What the fuck, Twig? You piece of shit! Wait, what? You, you, you're joking, right? No, I really almost did it. Like, I had my phone out and everything. If Lizzie hadn't dragged me on this trip, I probably would have. I'm not good. I'm a shithead. Lizzie shouldn't be dating me. Gene was right. And it's a little fucked up because he was being a misogynist, but he was actually right. I do suck, and I'm fine with it. That's just who I am, and I love it. So fuck off. Love it. Sue me if you don't like it. But good luck finding a judge who'll take that case. Or a lawyer. Fuck it. You're a fucking idiot. Well, Jesus. I was about to do a, a whole thing about how we should take a step back and slow things down. But you know what? Fuck you, Tweak. Yeah, yeah, Tweak. Fuck you. Hey, thanks for coming to get me. Seriously, it, it means a lot. Uh, okay, enough. Let's go. You got it. Smell you later, Tweak. We're back. You're safe. Uh, I mean, fuck you. And a fuck you, too. Okay, happy reunion. Everyone's fine. Can, can we just get back to bounty hunting? Yeah, 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 yeah. Clug just sent over the data on Nipulon, so you can head out while I fix Les to it. Did you, uh, know how much firepower this guy's packing? He's got to be at least ten times as powerful as any of you other Gatlians. Wait, you really think you're going to be able to fix him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have them all patched up by the time you get back. You're serious? That 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 soon? Yeah. Don't worry about it, kid. Your friend's gonna be just fine. Old Papa Jean watched a bunch of GooTube tutorials, and now he knows his way around cybernetics. That's 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 great. It's it's just what you don't sound too happy. You know how hard I've been working to save this guy. Fuck. Whew, okay. I guess it's now or never, bounty hunter. Can you set the other guns down on the table for me, real quick? 
Hey, everybody. I, I, I need to come clean about... Uh, well, this is way tougher than I thought. Spit it out. Yeah, spit it out. No, I, I, I can't. I, you're going to hate me. Dad, we, we don't have secrets. We're a family. Well, hold on. I might decide to hate him. It's okay, Kenny. You can tell us. Oh, just fucking say it. Okay, fine. If you don't hear it from me, you're just going to hear it from Les Dewitt when he wakes up. Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason the G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'd be mad. I, I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... fuck. He's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. Kenny, how? That doesn't even make sense. How can it be your fault? I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But, but how could that be possible? We didn't even have interstellar travel on Gatlas yet. I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and I was going nowhere, and, and, and he took me with him on these adventures, and it was supposed to be, you know, this fun, awesome thing, and, but then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. It all happened so fast, I, I thought they killed Les Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. I didn't know he, I didn't know he was gonna survive. You mean you didn't think you'd ever have to tell us the truth. No, 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 that's not it. I, I... Oh, this is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See? I'm not the biggest fuck up here. Not now, dude. Everyone, please. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. Let's just... Oh, okay. Let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Sure. Easy. Done. What's next on the agenda? Forgive Garmantuous too? Come on. That, 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 that's not fair. Don't fight. I'm sure we can all figure this out. No, Creature. He can't just drop that bomb on us and expect everything to be the same. I, I'm sorry. Look, I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. Nippilon may not stay where he is for long, so I know things aren't... The ideal, but, uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy, you don't mean that. Enough! Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. You're professionals! You're bounty hunters! Act like it! Mm-hmm. Fine. <laughs> okay, yeah. Gather everyone up. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Tarine, so we gotta strike now. Can you handle that? She, meanwhile, with strawberry lips cajoled. Let's just get this over with. Writhing on burning coals. Woof. That was a doozy, huh? It's just one thing after another, isn't it? I don't know about all that, but uh, I'm glad you got your sister back. Thanks for doing that. I learned in the amorous heart that when men I crushed to my dreaded heart or to their mumbling kisses bear my bust. So... She, meanwhile, with strawberry lips cajoled, and like an asp writhing on burning coal. Huh, so your civilization had computers at least, that's good. I really wasn't sure how primitive you were. Thine ancient conscience in my couches deep. I am so learned in the amorous heart, that when men I crush to my dreaded heart, or to their mumbling kisses bear my bust, so frail. I guess that really puts things into perspective. Hey, thanks again, and good luck. Stay safe out there. Angels damn themselves for me.